It is 4.21 in the morning and I am up. I'm on my way to Las Vegas, Nevada for this bowling tournament. I'm headed there right now and uh, I'm going to take y'all with me on this journey. So we're going to eat. We're going to have fun. We're going to see some sights. So uh, let's go ahead and get it. Y'all come with me. Okay, let's go. Just touchdown. Went on them bags to come right now. But it's time to have some fun, y'all. Freaking Uber madness out here right now. That's where we're staying. Give a little look at the room. Basic room, kind of old style looking, you know, with the art and then the welcome. Give you a little view of the outside. Standard bathroom, nothing special. Just a beautiful view of the mountains. Let's check this out. Not gonna lie, I'd be scared as hell being up there. And this is why I plan on coming to win at right here. This is why I'm going to win. You're right. This is the Orleans Bowl now. Oh, yeah. I'm coming to knock some heads off, y'all. And then this happened. Not 1,000% happy. Just, just finished with the No Tap Bowling Tournament. And I sucked. I was so freaking tired, man. The jet lag kicked my ass. Like, I'm in there like, like, like this. Trying to bowl. Trying to get up. It took me to the third game to finally get some stuff rolling. I bowled a 189, a 183, and a 224. I only had one good game, that was a 224. So, uh, tomorrow's the real tournament. Now I'm about to head to town, see what else um, I get myself into. Was gonna go swimming, but they closed at seven. Seven, why, why? Oh well, about to try this spot out. I'll let y'all know what I think of it. <laughs> This is the Fireside Lounge at the Pepper Mill. So to get me started, I have to grab me one of these Hennessy margaritas with the home girl, it's Amy B right here. Let me see. That's so damn good. I have no food in my system. So because I have no food in my system, the Hennessy margarita is taking effect right now. I, I used this size book in high school. Look how big this thing is. And the portions are even bigger. What's your go-to? What's your go-to? I can't remember. It's been a year, but I know I like the pancakes. Okay. So right here, I got these pancakes. Three mammoth pancakes, butter and syrup, add pecans or walnut. Now she says she's going to eat one. No, I, I'm I don't believe her. I'm going to at least eat half of one. Trust me. Okay. You got to remember, being from Kentucky, mammoth cake. <laughs> we gonna okay. see. We gonna see. So I had to add sugar to my tea because in the, on the West Coast they don't have sweet tea. And they got unsugared. So I got this rainbow sugar that I added to it. Look, y'all, my drink is snowing sugar right now. So we just found out that this place used to have uh, Elvis and what they say the Rat Pack. Marilyn Monroe, all of them used to hang out here. Oh, and goddamn, gee, hold on. I want y'all to see how this is the size of the plate. I don't even know if this would do it justice. Let me, y'all. Do you see how big this um is? This is, y'all, what the? F and remember what she said, and the combo was small. So I had the combo. Look at. Bro, they don't even do. I tried to warn him. <laughs> Got to listen to these big windows now. We know. They don't even do it justice. Like y'all looking at it from a counter point of view, but this that's is not like, even doing it justice. Like it's about a nine inch plate. Yeah, this is. These are nine, eight to nine. Inch, I would say nine inch. Damn that! That's about nine, ten inch. Yeah, it's about probably. I got three of those. I told you, stupid ass. Comment down below if you feel like I'm gonna finish all up, or if she's gonna have to eat one, like she said. 
Yeah, you recording. Yeah, big right there. How you put the whole thing in your mouth? Why do you look like that? Uh, I'm eating crow right now. I'm actually I'm eating pancakes. But I'm eating crow because Jamie said that I would not be able to finish all these pancakes. And god damn it, she ain't lie. I'm, I'm I ain't even put a dent into it and I'm already full. I'm honest, Jay. I can't tell a lie. I really can't. I cannot tell a lie for my life. I can't. That's damn lie. You lied to your kids about who their daddy was. No, I didn't. That's who his stepdaddy is. There's a difference. Yeah. I damn near finished it, but I couldn't. I had to tap out. Went through four things of syrup. That's how much I got left, though. After giving me half a half. Right, I gave half a half, and I still couldn't finish it. You are a pussy, you know. So we just finished here at the pepper mill. JB, what would you rate the pepper mill? What's your rating you're going to get the pepper mill? Anytime. Out of 10. It's been consistent, so I'll like, say about a 9, 10. It's just the drinks for me. That's the only thing. It's yeah, I'm going to give them about a good 8 and a half. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. So right now, we headed to this place right here called the Pink Box. I heard it's like the one of some of the best donuts in Vegas. It's time to go get some donuts. Look at this big ass machine. It's a giant gumball machine. So it's inside of the bagel spot with the deli. But what we coming for right here is Pink Box. I don't know. You just dropped it right there. Yeah. American food. Thank you. Apple fritters look nuts. Let's take a look. Got that blue face, the peanut butter and jelly, and that orange cream sickle. Ooh. Later. Y'all, it has been a day. Back in my room. About to let y'all know what these donuts hitting for. We're going to start off with this blue face, y'all. Must I remind y'all. This is a croissant blueberry donut. Let's see. It's got the croissant dough. It's super flaky. This blue face right here, it's fire. Next up, peanut butter and oh, peanut butter and jelly. What the hell was that? Of course, it's got the peanut butter on top. It's got the jelly in the middle. This can't help but to be good. Yeah. You're literally eating a peanut butter jelly sandwich in a form of a donut. Oh, I understand why pink donuts got this reputation, but y'all, that's what I'm looking forward to. A damn donut that looks like a popsicle. When I saw this on the picture, I'm like, bro, they got popsicle donuts? This is the most creative donut I think I've ever seen. Let's go in. Bruh. What you're not gonna tell me is I'm not eating an orange cream sickle pop. This right here is crazy. You don't get your hands dirty either? I completely understand why this place is one of the best places for donuts in Las Vegas. If you're ever in Las Vegas, or if you live in Las Vegas, try Pink Box. You're not gonna be disappointed though. That place fire. I'm still doing more vlog here in Las Vegas, so I got more stuff to do. So uh, let's go, y'all come watch with me. Let's go swimming right now. We got a little pool party going on out here. Check out the pool. Big ass hotel in the back back there. Pool right there. Getting that jacuzzi right there. Super duper relaxing. Jamie chilling right there. Drinking a little drinky drink. In the warm jacuzzi. Oh yeah, tomorrow gonna be another good one. Tomorrow. So right now I'm at this place called the Copper Whisk Cafe. About to grab me some breakfast. Let's take a look at this menu. Nope. Where are my pancakes? Where are my pancakes? Where we at? Where we at? There we go. Might do some pancakes. Might do some French toast. Might do a waffle. We'll see. So here's what I got, y'all. I got these two blueberry pancakes. I learned my lesson from the other day with the big pancakes. And I got double hash browns. Nice and well done with a little fancy butter and some syrup. Y'all know it's about to go down, right? You know it's about to go down. Let's go bold. Yeah. 
got to finish that game strong. Got one more to go. Let's go ahead and get it done, baby. Are you just going? You going to video bomb me, huh? Okay. Yeah. Hey guys and girls, it's chow time. So I'm at this spot right here called Low Lows Chicken and Waffles. So I'm with my homeboy George. So J G Money said we got to come over here to Lowe's and try this jokers out. So we about to go in, look at the food, look at the menu, and see what it's hidden for. Let me show you what we got. We got the sweet potatoes right there. We got the mac and cheese. We got the collard greens. We got the red beans and rice with the cornbread. But then, also got some fried okra. My boy George got that catfish with the red beans and rice, the fries. I think I'm about to go in, y'all. Sweet potatoes, seven out of 10. Mac and cheese, I'm gonna give that a good eight out of 10. Collard greens, eight and a half out of 10. Red beans, eight out of 10. Okra, that's a good six and a half out of 10. Y'all, let me tell you something real quick. I had to double back, because this cornbread, Oh my god. That's a 10 out of 10. My Arnold Palmer, which you can see is gone. That's a 10 out of 10. You gotta come to Lolo's in Las Vegas. For shizzle. You will absolutely love it. I'm gonna let y'all know what it looked like when that banana pudding come out though. A few inches later. It doesn't look right. Extremely disappointing. <laughs> this is the one thing you don't get when you come here. Extremely. Extremely disappointing. So I just finished eating that Lolo's. Everything overall, 9 out of 10. The only reason I ain't giving it an extra point is that damn banana pudding. But 9 out of 10, if you're in Vegas, Lolo's right there. Check it out.